interesting happen upstairs? No, nah, not really. Is this, is this something that every organization does like the next day after the season that you've been with, uh, just grabs the guys? And... Yeah, pretty much kind of checks in, you know, goes over the season pretty much. Did tell you what to do to get ready for next year? Or for coming, you know, next year like yeah, that? you know, just, uh, you know, Everybody's kind of, I guess, taking a step back, taking a breather uh, now, and uh, you know, start gearing up for uh, for what's to come. So, are you have any expectations of, of coming back? I know that you're free agent. No, I'm just, uh, you know, I enjoyed playing here. Unfortunately, it, you know, ended sooner than we had expected, and um, you know, going to take some time off and uh, you know, just kind of collect my thoughts and you know, see what the future has in store. There any particular variables you'll ultimately be blamed as far as mulling your future? No, not really. No. What were your, I guess, sort of thoughts on your season as a whole? It kind of was in and out of the rotation, sort of unusual. Yeah, I mean, it was, you know, it was tough kind of in and out of the rotation, like you said. Um, you know, when uh, when my number was called, I tried to go out there and, uh, you know, do the, uh, do what, you know, the coaches asked of me and, uh, you know, stayed uh, stayed ready for when they uh, for when they called. You were seemingly healthy after dealing with some problems before. But was the demos more frustrating not to have a regular role because you were healthy and do what you did in the past? It was, but um, you know, it was it's good to be healthy. You know, I felt uh, you know to go through the year and be be healthy uh, the entire time is you know after last year was tough and uh, you know I feel good about that. Talking about playing with this organization, you played in a few places. How this is different, maybe from other places. Um, you know, it's great. Um, it's really an honor to play here. Um, so much history. Um, great fans, great players, and uh, you know, every year you know you're going to be competing for a championship, and um, you know, it's it's a real honor. It was a great experience. Is there any particular feedback as far as what Mike gave, as far as just things to work on the offseason? Not really. Um, you know, just uh, just met with him briefly, and um, you know, that was a kind of an informal kind of thing. Troy, you're always able to find a, a role in what they almost call like a stretch four, and just your mm -hmm. shooting ability, and, and how obviously you can find and play so many of those minutes. How did you see that working, like when he has skills in the hoop too, but he had to play outside away from the rim? Well, I mean, um, you know, the way our offense was was designed, it's to utilize those guys. I mean, I don't, you know, there's no team in the league that has better bigs. You know, um, we got the starting uh, center on the All Star team, and we've got a guy who's been All Star. I don't know how many times. Um, so they, um, you know, like you said, played the majority of the minutes, and whatever I was uh, going in there, just tried to space the floor, and uh, you know, whether I was in there with Drew trying to give him space to operate or. You know, screen and uh, open things up. I think is pretty much what my role was and what they had me, you know, trying to do. What did it mean to you, just I guess on a professional level, to be able to show the rest of the teams and the league that you are actually healthy right after last year? I think it was it was huge for me to be able to to be healthy. You know, just um, the year before, I was just I wasn't healthy the whole year, and it was really frustrating. So to be able to uh, to get out there and and you know when my number was called, go out there and play. Uh, you know, was uh, step in the right direction.